What's up, heaves? It's been a minute. Really busy. It's not where this video is gonna go, though. So we're actually at the gym. I had to go and, like our gym. I had to go and do a few things before we headed out. But, 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 surprise. We are going to Pennsylvania in the GTR, if you haven't seen it. Um, just been really busy with life and gym recently. Um, so just getting out of New York for a little. And by for a little, I mean literally a couple hours. So yeah, we're gonna shut up and start driving. And we'll explain to you why we're going to Pennsylvania. So we're gonna start driving and I'll pick up the camera and we'll see you guys up there. up here um so we're in king of prussia right now no clue where we are i uh, just got a location to come here uh and then we're gonna head out to so whitney's gym which i believe is power building um and i just need i wanted to kind of just take the car and get out of like new york and everything so for a while so i don't know if i'm going back tonight or leaving uh or staying here or uh you know spending the night or everything but i'm up here right now i'm, I'm kind of getting loose and then we're gonna head over to the gym in about an hour or so smash a leg workout see what's going on with whitney check the gym out check a new environment out i was talking to mikey and i was like i haven't been to like a gym in so long where i've been just a member so this is gonna get exciting, and it's hot shit out, and the GTR is struggling with the AC, with no AC, so we're just waiting for somebody to pull up, and then I believe we'll head out to the gym. So yeah, stay tuned. Alright guys, so as you can see, 
we're at Power Building. It's Whitney's gym. Um, we're far from home, far from Ironfall. Uh, but as you can see, we hit a top single on squat at 170. Um, the gym's really good. I, we knew the gym was good. Uh, it's a very at-home vibe. Uh, same, same, same like personality and characteristics. Um, uh, one of our members actually lives up here, uh, so we came up here to lift with her. But this is the gym. So pretty much, I mean, if you follow his page, uh, right, it's the same setup: deadlift platforms, uh, and then squat, the power racks, and everything. Uh, just nothing really different, honestly. Just it, it's a similar setup, similar square footage, similar vibes. So, but I, like I said, I just need to get away from home. Uh, we took the GTR out up here. It started raining on the way up here, which is fine. Um, as long as it wasn't like catastrophic, which was fine. Uh, Cause New York, it said the rain was around 12 o'clock. So that's when we left. Um, we, we had to do some stuff at the gym this morning and then we came out. But other than that, we're up here. We've been working, not really recording. I thought I was gonna record a lot more, but just really, so the reason why I came up here, um, was to get away from everything. Like at the gym, it's always like, at, you know, back home, it's always uh, the workout and the training, um, it's kind of divided, right? Cause it's always like at answering questions in the gym or getting drinks or membership options or whatever. And here I was telling um, Alessandra that like, it's literally just me and her, like nobody knows me. It's like, I can literally just come in here and be a member and have a great workout. Um, and I, I, we don't get that anymore. But like I said, that's like right, right like one of the trade-offs. But it's good stuff. So we hit our top single. Um, so the top single was supposed to be at a nine at 160. Um, I shot it at 170. I'm just not gonna do the working sets. And then, uh, so we're doing dumbbell RDLs, single leg extensions and curls, lunges. And then I'm going to, I'll usually finish with abs, but I'm hitting, um, we're gonna finish it off with hip thrust with Alessandra, and we're gonna cap it there. And then we actually brought uh, Whitney up some shirts, so I'm gonna see if he opened those up before we left, see if we can get a picture with him. And uh, yeah, so we're gonna put the camera down, we're gonna start working, and we'll go from there. So we just finished up. Uh, so what Whitney has here that we don't have back home is the individual 
hamstring curl, standing. Um, I usually back home on the quad extension, kind of reverse myself. I think you guys see me do it and I'll do it that way. Um, but the single one just hits way different. Um, I didn't record the lunges. Uh, I did just a 25 on one side. Um, that way when I'm doing the opposite leg, it forces me to keep myself stable and hold, uh, like kind of hold my obliques in place and everything. Uh, but other than that, I'm gonna start, I'm gonna hit abs right now. Um, this time I'm just finishing front squats. Um, and then we're gonna hip thrust together and I think we'll cap it at that. Um, Whitney just started benching. We'll probably talk to him in a little bit. Um, he got his guys recording over there as well. They shoot cannon, I think, unfortunately. <laughs> but um, but no, just good vibes. It's, it's the same vibes from back home, uh, which is why I wanted to get out of New York and kind of experience it. Um, so all good stuff. Other than that, everything's moving well. I thought I was gonna be fatigued from the car ride, uh, but we, when I was shooting the car, um, we sat down and we chatted a little bit um, and I got kind of loose. So we were moving around as opposed to sitting in the car and the GTR is super comfortable. It's not like a stiff ride. So other than that, hips were open wide. So the 375, I was just telling um, Alessandro too, like out of, po out of the hole, um, I kind of fell back a little, I don't know. And you'll see in the video, I kind of got shaky on the way up. Um, so like if I'm not out of the hole together as a full, like one structured body and you know, I kind of get shaky. So like I, the firing order was a little whack, um, but it definitely felt like a nine, nothing crazy. It was, it was overshot like a little, wasn't like crazy. So we'll cap it there. Uh, we're gonna finish ab work and then we'll pick back up when we're doing hip thrusts. Okay, so we just finished front squat. Oh, my front squat. See, I'm roasted. Uh, we just finished hip thrust, uh, and we chatted with Whitney a little. So, this is like, I mean, what we came in at, we came in at 5:30. It's 8:11. So, like, this is usually how it is, even back home. It's just very docile, calm environment. Or not calm, like a uh, chill workout. Not like a, uh, not like back home, like what we're doing now. But just super, super chill. Winnie's a great guy. Uh, as to be expected. It's the, it's the same fucking vibe. It's great. Um, and Alessandra and her sister come up here. Um, Alessandra's gonna be jumping back. She's doing stuff up here. But, um... Super great gym, though. Super great vibes. Um, so we're probably gonna grab some food or maybe even a snack. Um, we're definitely gonna get... I'm gonna get, like, a Gatorade and then probably hit the road. Um, I don't know if I'm staying up here tonight, but... Yeah, that's where we're gonna end it with the video. Uh, or at least with the gym portion of it. Um, I probably won't pick it up again, unless I pick it up in the morning. Um, Cause I can't, like I was thinking about a bunch of stuff up here, coming up here, like for the video and everything. But as soon as I got up here, with the, uh, with like a calm environment, and just having the gym, or like just having nobody talk to me and really dial in the focus, uh, it was like, it was game over. So that's why I wasn't recording too much. So yeah, so we'll cap it here. And then if I have anything to say, we'll pick up the camera tomorrow. It's a Sunday, so it should be pretty calm. Yeah, we'll see you back home. Good morning, peeps. We're home. So I just took a sneak peek at the car. So eight hours of driving. So let's see, we got that. Right, we got here. Here. This is what blows my mind. No. <laughs> Look at this shit. Let me see if I can focus this. So here we go. Just like.
just super beat up. But that's fine, that's what eight hours will do. Uh, so we're back home. Everything went great. Uh, we are gonna go pick up food now. We're gonna head to the gym. And then we will wrap this video up. I'll give you like closing conclusions on when we touch back at the gym. Okay guys, so we're back home. We're at the gym doing some work here. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, closing, closing conclusion. Closing conclusion, right? Um, no, closing thoughts. Uh, Whitney's gym was awesome, great. Uh, Super great vibe. I mean, the, the reason I went out there to begin with um, was to just kind of get away from New York for a little. Um, we took the GTR out there, obviously, which you guys saw in the video. Um, I actually, uh, actually some good news too. I bought a rig, like a setup for the GTR so I can start like putting the camera, uh, putting the camera down or setting it up as we, uh, as we drive. Um, because it, it's hard to hold like a bulky ca uh, camera um, and I'll probably get like a small GoPro or something uh, to get like some in-action shots or something like that because it's hard. Um, it's already harder. Like, because when I'm driving that car, I'm, I'm very attentive. I'm driving the car. I'm not coasting realistically. Like, I'm driving, driving, um, and I don't want to. I don't want to hold a bulky camera and like kind of record it. That's risking my safety. But <sighs> overall, it, it was great. Uh, Mike just said something. But, yeah, I mean, people just got to be really grateful for what we have around here, you know, because Whitney's gym, you know, um, given the area it's in and everything is, is a great, is a great, great, I'm sure that's the best gym in town. And then coming back home and seeing, you know, all this, you know, all the great equipment and going out there, um, just good quality is hard to find. And, and realistically, everybody can eat. Um, you know, everybody can win. A lot of people don't think that in society that, like, you know, another person's success will, <clears throat> will hinder somebody else's. And realistically, there's plenty of success and money to go around in the world. So, but other than that, I think that's good. One of our guys just walked in. What's up? Um, but, yeah, it was about, it was about a three-hour drive um, from, from my spot, right? So, because it was two and a half from from the gym and that's where we left from in the morning because i had to come and do some work but it's three hours it's three hours from my place because coming home from the gym and then i also went to king of prussia um which one uh with uh that's where alessandra lives so that's where we were and i shot the car a little um so like I, and that was like 10 15 minutes from the gym just everything is very spaced out up there we're, i'm so used to like new york being every everything being tight and i tr i travel a good amount um, and by travel, I mean sometimes just taking the car, like not really out of, uh, not really out of America, but just like driving a lot of places. And um, we're just really fortunate to have a lot of close stuff in New York. And I don't think a lot of people understand that. So if you're not like pushing your, you know, like out of your zone, you won't really know how good you have things here. Because I was texting Mikey and I'm like, yo, people really don't understand how great they have it here to have like full unrestricted access to you know all these kilos and and quality racks and like that shit you don't find in regular gyms so i literally came back and uh i was just talking with mike and i was like yo they really like people really really don't get it um and some people do some some members do honestly um but for for the guys who really don't appreciate it guys like you really gotta understand that there's not gyms around like this and even if there are there's few and far between like they're not they're not mass produced so it just gave me a whole nother perspective coming into the gym. Um, I gave Mikey some like leeway, some ideas, uh, like, you know, moving forward, how we can treat everything with the proper respect and like, you know, and everything it deserves. So, but yeah, I needed to get away and free, free up my mind. Driving the GTR for just eight, for eight hours was ridiculously relaxing. Um, and it did it without a hiccup. Which I, w I was, I'm not gonna lie, I did kind of doubt the car. It was, it was kind of scary, cause I was like, oh shit. I was like, I, I thought something would happen. But honestly, that just comes to show you, again, quality work, right, over time. It's a damn near 30 year old car. Uh, didn't even skip a beat. So, that's what we'll close it here. Workout was great, but it's great, it's great to be back home. It's great to be back home. 
is only away for a day. But honestly, at the work rate that me and Mike are doing, little shit like that, like just will like reset everything and then give us that much more energy moving forward. So stick around, it's gonna get better. Hopefully sooner rather than later. Thank you all for watching. Peace out.